Hello everyone. So today we'll be talking about the integration of x times cos square 2x. So let's see how this is done. So we're not going to use any new concept to solve this question. We are going to use the formula of integration by parts here as well. But then before applying that formula, let's change this in terms of cos 4x. So we know the formula cos 4x is equal to 2 cos square 2x minus 1. So we are going to substitute the value of cos square 2x from this equation, trigonometric relation rather. So x times cos 4x plus 1 whole divided by 2 dx so this multiplies this then this again multiplies this one so it is x times cos 4x upon 2 dx plus 1 upon 2 x dx so over here we are going to use the formula of integration by parts so let's follow the eyelid rule so this is a rule which is which helps the uh, integration process a little easier so i represents um, inverse l represents logarithm a represents algebraic t represents trigonometric and e represents exponential so whichever comes earlier is given the priority and is differentiated whereas the other one is integrated so x is algebraic cos 4x is trigonometric so let's suppose x to be u and cos 4x to be v uh, even if you don't follow this rule uh, you, you are going to get the answer but then it may be a little complicated so this rule makes the solving process a little easier so this is u this is v or you can uh, do the otherwise as well so you can make this v and uh, suppose this to be u but then for now let's suppose this to be u and this to be v uh, so 1 upon 2 comes outside this uh, and let's make curly bracket so this is u means it comes outside cos 4x dx minus the big bracket dx upon dx integration cos 4x dx big bracket close dx curly bracket close and plus this so it is 1 upon 2 times x square upon 2 uh, so is equal to 1 upon 2 the curly bracket x times the integration of cos 4x is sine 4x upon 4 minus uh, dx upon dx is of course 1 and then the integration of cos 4x is sine 4x upon 4 dx close the curly bracket plus x square upon 4 is equal to 1 upon 2 uh, x times upon 4 minus 1 upon 4 this comes outside mm. the integration of sine 4x is minus cos 4x upon 4 so that minus multiplies this minus it becomes plus cos 4x Upon 4 plus x square upon 4 so now is equal to so let's multiply the 1 upon 2 with the elements inside the curly bracket so it is x times sine 4x upon 4 times 2 is 8 plus cos 4x 
upon 4 times 4 is 16, 16 times 2 is 32 plus x square upon 4 plus c. We can also take the LCM or we can just leave it as it is. But then let's take the LCM. So x times sine 4x multiplied by 4 plus cos 4x plus 8x square whole divided by 32 plus c. Yes, this is the final answer to this question. I hope you learned how to do this and hope to see you in another video. Thank you.